The stage is set and the glittering prize awaits one of these two teams. But which one in the 2022 FIFA World Cup final? We'll have all the action for you next on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Portugal versus Argentina. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. Uh, can he finish? What a big chance that was. Keeper has the ball. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Rui Patricio begins in goal. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. Messi. Well, that pass easy on the eye and not cleared away properly. Well, that's the end of that for now. Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, can they be creative from here? Opportunity. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. He's driven in the corner. Terrific piece of anticipation. And he clears the danger. Ronaldo putting his body on the line. And they might be onto something. He's given it straight to the opposition. Cristiano Ronaldo. Messi Messi very quick thinking there skipping away how about the cross can he put them in front and it's in we've just witnessed the first goal of this 2022 World Cup final one to save her. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. goal 1-0 then. For Argentina. Alvarez. It might be on for them. And the cross comes to nothing. And a good take under duress there. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And Messi carries it forward. What's he going to do from this position? A fine reading of the situation. Ruben Neves. And Messi in a good position. What can he and his teammates do? Guerrero. Dalo. Moving the ball nicely, trying to carve out the equaliser. Far from a good pass. Can he finish? Oh, God, it is! The equaliser in this final. What next at 
the drama. once more on the back of that very important equaliser 1-1 one, one. Well, the attack looks promising and that is going to be a free kick well, spot on for that challenge Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. Enzo Fernandez. Marcos Acuna. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. And short it is. Now a decent position. Able to get a ball, and the referee has given it. It will be a penalty. Can they forge ahead? Oh, he's guessed correctly and saved it. Messi with the corner. It comes to nothing in the end. Marcos Acuna. Could be. Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. Nicely saved. And there it is, the half-time whistle. And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, Whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Using space on the opposite flank now. Really good challenge. A chance maybe from the wide position. But really sticking to their task defensively. Bruno Fernandes. Diogo Dallo on the ball. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. So making the substitution now. Shot attempted. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Fernandez. Messi. Rodrigo de Paul. Beautifully disguised ball. Just needs to stay calm. Palmed away by the keeper. Well, the keeper's made a good save, but you just sense a goal is coming soon. Well, just take a look at the stats. They've certainly been created opportunities, but they just haven't been clinical enough in front of goal. Some of their finishing has been really poor. That has to improve at some point in this game. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Alvarez. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Crossing opportunity. And no way through. And fine work by Argentina to recover possession. Something to worry about here. Oh, and it goes to propel them into the lead. Just what they wanted. Well, this is really poor defensively. Just look how exposed the keeper is. He's got absolutely no chance there.
so the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. Number 10, Lionel Messi. Bernardo Silva. Keeping the ball moving. Dangerous looking through ball. And the challenge, crisp and clean. Lionel Messi. Messi. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Into the final 20 minutes. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. A fine reading of the situation. Messi and gobbled up with ease by the keeper Ruben Neves and given away now who can he play it to a well, disappointing end to the move Silva. Now let's see what they can do here. Well, the supporters think it's on. Body on the line. Ten minutes to go. Now it's a really poor challenge. Now what's the referee going to do about it? Romero. Very quick thinking there. We're getting it forward, but they need an equaliser. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Ronaldo. And you don't want to lose possession there. Still can be dangerous. Who's going to lift the trophy? Incredible! Well, the initial save is a good one, as you can see, but unfortunately it drops straight to an opponent. A bit unlucky, really. Again here, this has been quite the roller coaster ride. On the offensive, is there to be late excitement? It's going to be a throw in for Portugal here. Ronaldo. He'll be delighted to have won the ball having made that difficult challenge. So two minutes of stoppage time here. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Far from a good pass. Well, it was a promising avenue of attack, but the momentum has been halted. And you wouldn't be surprised to see the card handed out. Well, that's it for the 90 minutes. But this is not over, and two 15-minute periods of extra time to come. Well, back underway here, and it's quite simple. Both teams must steal themselves for 30 extra minutes. Losing possession a bit easily.
plenty of support here Lionel Messi opportunity to take the lead and a goal this time applying the finishing touch just what the doctor ordered Well, let's see this again. What a pass this is from Messi. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. And the ball is moving again. 3-2. Silva. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. Bernardo Silva. Now well, they've given him too much space. This could square the game. Oh, but no! Heroism flashed in front of his eyes. Couldn't take the chance. Well, I think that's a poor miss. They really should be level now. Will they come to regret that? Lisandro Martinez. Marcos Acuna. Alvarez. Running with the ball confidently. And let's give credit to the defending. Ronaldo. Might be a chance here. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Lionel Messi. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. Messi. Messi cutting in from the flank. That's it, half-time in extra time. The second period still to come. Well, the big question, who will come out on top? We're into the second period of extra time here. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. A wonderful intervention. Martinez Well on the attack hunting for a late equalizer here Dallo On to Ronaldo, just cutting off the supply. Martinez, really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. Well, no way to put a positive spin on that one, disappointing. Well, I don't think he'll be on the next free kick, will he? That wasn't good at all. Bruno Fernandes Diogo Dallo on the ball good work to regain possession well, still time for them to level it Bruno Fernandes could level it 
and all square now. And you have to ask the question, is the time for either side to win it? Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. A final that will live long in the memory. It's not finished yet because it's going to come down to a penalty shootout to settle the outcome. And so the penalty shootout about to commence. And as a player, this is when you have to hold your nerve. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. And he steps up to take the shot. And slotted home right into the bottom corner. Excellent penalty. In it goes. Can he keep us cool? He had to score, and he does. Superb placement there. His turn to try to convert from the spot. And just like that, he's come up with the save. And that was an exquisitely taken penalty. You want a pressure cooker, this is it. He must score. Oh, that's it! The final act in the drama. One team jubilant, the other distraught. Well, what an ending to a very good tournament, and I think they fully deserve to win it. Maybe not in this manner, though, but it was great entertainment. It certainly was, and they're not going to forget this in a hurry. A proud moment for everyone involved with the club, but for their opponents, it's a case of trying to forget and move on as quickly as possible. Well, I think we should give them some credit, too. They played their part in what was an excellent contest. Some of their football was brilliant. Yes, fair play, Stuart. The party in full swing now. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here. Portugal, the world champions. And this is finally Portugal's time. Fully deserved. Best team in the world. Well, you have to give credit to the coach. He's been excellent, but so too the players and these fans. It's absolutely magnificent for them.